guys, welcome back to UA Studios. My name is Usayat Athar and I am your instructor for this tutorial. In this tutorial, I will show you guys how you can parse the JSON from the news API uh, using the Exios library. Then we will render this JSON of the news into our flat list using React Native hooks that are use state and use effect. Before we start, I want you guys to I hope you guys have subscribed to my channel UA Studios but if you haven't please subscribe by clicking at the bottom right corner of your screens. Let's begin by creating a new react native project. So go to terminal, move into project directory and start typing expo init, select minimal app. Uh, give it a name. I will give networking. It is installing all the dependencies required for this project. So let's move, wait for a few minutes. I will come back when it gets installed. The React Native project uh, set up successfully. Now into terminal type CD networking and then start a project expo start run then run on ios simulator We have to wait for a few minutes until it gets, it's getting running. Open this project uh, in the, into the Visual Studio code. Open networking here, networking open. When you create a new project, uh, this is how it looks. This is all the project directories. Uh, if you if you run the project, it will look like this whenever you create a new project. Now let's install all the dependencies required for this project. Uh, I will be using React Navigation for the uh, for the navigation purpose. So first, install this React Navigation library. Uh, go to terminal. Let's stop the server. Type npm install react navigation then I have written all the libraries to install so I will copy this npm install paste I will share all these uh, libraries in, in the description so you can copy from there It will take few minutes. Uh, I will come back when it gets installed. Now we have to run this command. So copy this and paste it. Uh, if we didn't run this command, uh, the React Native project will give us give us some error. So we have to install this thing. Then we have this.
then last all done for react navigation uh, you don't have to worry about these i will share all these uh, commands in the description we have installed all the dependencies uh, react uh, uh, needed for this project so let's uh, set up a uh, react navigation and go to app.js here remove all of these but first uh, uh, this project is is a news app will be a news app so we have to create a news home screen so create a new folder here type screen and then we would have Mm -mm. something went wrong remove this then create a new file call it home.js oh it's again creating a folder create a new file call it uh, news.js here start typing uh, the boiler code so import react from react import view style sheet text and let's say button from react native then constant news equals navigation equals return let's say text and type new screen then export default news save this file and now go to app.js here start typing import react from react then import create app container from react navigation import create stack navigator from react navigation stack then import news from screens news then we will type stack navigator equals create stack navigator news news save this file again constant app equals create app container here it here pass it this stack navigator then export default app save this file and then run this 
So in, our, in order to run this, we have to start the server. So navigate into the project directory and type expo start. It will run the server. Now run on iOS simulator. Refresh this app. As you can see, we have uh, this navigation bar with new screen. To make network calls, uh, we will be using uh, React uh, Axios. So let's install the Axios first. npm install Axios. So it get installed. Uh, we have this complete documentation here. Uh, we have we can call get methods, we can request post methods. It's a complete documentation. I recommend uh, you all guys to read uh, this documentation. For networking call, create a new folder. APIs. APIs here call create a new file news now type import axios from axios then export default axios dot create Here we will return base URL and our base URL will be we will fetch the news from news API. So go to this document. Here we have news API. Uh, we have to create a new registration when when we will get registered uh, in this news API.org, we will get this API key. So we have to add this API key into this endpoint. So when when you will uh, done with creating a uh, sign up, so go to this documentation. Here, go to top headlines. Then uh, we will use will be using this API. So copy this and paste it. For example, here. What we will be using uh, base URL, our base URL will be uh, from no, will be here, will be this. So paste it, then save this file. Now our next task would, would be by uh, would be creating a news card. So in order to create a news card we have to first look what components uh, I will display into this news card. So go to this API, go to this documentation, copy this and let's say paste in a browser. Uh, this API will return all the news of the US. So copy this, copy all this JSON and now go to json validator json formatter go to this paste it here as you can see this is a valid json here we have in the articles we have author title description and URL to image. So we will use all these points. So we, we need to create a card with title, description, 
then we will show image and at the and after after the image we will show the author name so we need to create a card with these components now in the visual studio code create a component folder components here create a new file a new cart dot js here write all the boiler code we use to write whenever create whenever we create a new file let's type import react from react import view style sheet text image from react native then constant news card equals return view here return text with title news card then at the bottom export default news card then if i save this and in my news new screen i will import news card from components news card here add this news card we need to add view now let's save this file and run this we need to start a server okay we forgot to add invertis commas with react native save run it again as you can see our news card component added here let's start designing our news card news card uh, what we will gonna show go to json we have a title and description so let's create this will going to be at our title so title let's give this text copy it paste it then we will show them author so text again here let's copy this title
then I want to show the image so image then we will have this description text again with this uh, description Then what we have, uh, description URL, I think that, that's it, uh, we don't have anything more. Okay, then save this file. As you can see, uh, this is title, then we have author name, then the image is hidden because we haven't set any source yet. Then we have this description okay now let's style these things now let's add a constant for style constant styles equals style sheet dot create create uh, what we have we have uh, this title so title then we would have uh, this description title then description then we have image then we have author author now let's add uh, dimensions from react native comma dimensions so that i can get a screen width and height constant width comma height equals dimensions into window window get window save this file okay now let's style uh, for first title with into with let's add some margin left and right margin left give it 10 I what I want I want I don't want to give a constant end I want to give a ratio so what I will do I will do with into 0 0.1 I want 10% uh, of the width okay then margin right equals with into 0 0.1 okay we have margin left we have margin right then margin top 5 into uh, for margin top I want the same as this so with into no that should be less i think we should give margin margin width into 0 0.10 
okay now uh, should give a color to be black okay font size to be 20 now for description i want to give width width then margin same as this copy this paste it here then we have color for color i would like to give a gray color for description then for font size want to give 18 font right now for image now image for image width equals width height into height GHT divided by 3 I think it should be 3.5 or maybe 4 and for margin let's say for margin left For margin left with into 0 0.1 <coughs> sorry for margin right with into 0 0.1 for margin top let's give it margin vertical so it will give for the top and the bottom I want height 0.5 5 percent of the height okay now what left you have this author uh, okay now for author I want to give margin let's say margin vertical to width now height to 0. Point three now margin horizontal with into zero point one zero and the font font size I want uh, fifteen font color color to be light gray okay save this file and for the title I want to give some font weight now font weight bold now save this file and add these styling into our components so style equals styles dot title okay this is author so style equals styles dot author okay then we have this image so style equals what is it a uh, styles image then for this description we have style equals styles dot description save this file and run it it says uh, 
okay light gray is not valid i think gray would be <coughs> sorry we have play with these things so we have okay for title i have set 0 0.10 this marcher marcher so what i want 0 0.05 if i save this okay this looks fine now we have to set for this uh author okay where is author here it is we have margin vertical this should be 0 0.03 margin horizontal should be 0 0.01 or maybe 5 okay then Okay, it look fine now, but thing for vertical, I think I should give vertical, I should give margin bottom to be, let's give it same as this one, save, still, okay. And zero if what if fab. This looks better or should I should give some more okay margin horizontal okay then give margin vertical with into 0 0.02 save it 0 0.03 okay. it's look fine okay now for image what I want image to be Give six comma two zero point zero five zero point five. Now for margin vertical, I think I should give it point two. Now save it. Okay that's the area for the image now let's do it for description description <coughs> sorry okay now for the description let's give it 0 0.05 let's give it vertical first vertical okay now give margin horizontal width into 0 0.02 now i think it looks fine way much better now what i will do i will create a card to it okay in order to do this uh, i think we need to add style for this view so card view okay then add style was styles dot card view 
okay here background color should it would should be white then i need to add margin give it 5 save it as you can see we have this card now okay now i want let's give it some more margin i guess yeah that's better let's get, uh, give some border and uh, shadow to this card view so border radius i want this to be uh, with into 0 0.02 or maybe 5 0 0.5 then what I want I want to add some shadow so shadow color to 0 0 0 then shadow offset to width zero comma height one then shadow offset sorry opacity city I want zero point eight then shadow radius to be one okay save this file and if i run it as you can see i have added uh, the rounded color with the border and the shadow now let's play with some of this 0 0.5 if i okay five okay I think this should be three okay now we have height and width let's see if I do this what will happen 2.5 I think I think it's fine now we can play with it let's give the ratio to this one as well This looks fine. I think now I think everything looks fine. Hmm. Okay. What should we do now? Uh, yeah I think that all this all things looks fine now to me okay now what I will do now let's start implementing the uh, network API using excuse uh, before that uh, I will be using uh, react native hooks so what is hooks Hooks uh, are used to manage state in the functional classes, in your functional components. So I will be using two types of hooks, uh, use state and use effect. So let's use this, import react, then use state, 
and use affect from react then import api uh, what was the name of that api news api news api from apis news okay then what we'll gonna what we will do we will uh, create a function let's say constant news response equals async then constant response equals await then news api dot get here uh, we need to pass the url so go to news document uh, from here let's copy from top till the api key we have added uh, this base url into our news api so let's copy this and paste it in here right okay then let's console the response response dot data dot articles okay, let's print this response dot data now what we have to do we have to call this uh, news response okay so we will use a uh, use effect hook from react native so use effect into news response then the second parameter would be empty why we are uh, calling this news response into use effect because uh, when uh, whenever we update the state uh, it will update the response so we have to call it in a function uh, that is in a hook that is use effect so it will be called only once okay then save this file if I run this okay sorry then save this file and run it okay then go to con terminal you can see uh, I have fetched the news API now next we have to use a uh, use state so that uh, uh, this this was a async await uh, constant now let's say you want to make a function without async await so let's create a new function function uh, get news news from api then what we'll do uh, use uh, new api dot get now pass this url then use then let's say a function with response here just uh, console log the response dot data then let's say uh, we were unable to fetch the news uh, let's say it gives it gives us some error so we we want to show this error so catch function error then console 
log error okay and comment out this call it here so get news from api okay save this thing and run it again you can see the news api get fetch okay so now what we have to do uh we will use we we have to get this response news array and use it with the use state then let's create it now let's add a news array with the use state so constant uh, news set news then use it use state with an empty array Init uh, here we pass it what will be the initializing value so we want to use with empty array okay then here set news pass it with response dot data dot articles so, uh, we, let's check what was the key for this articles we have this articles key copy it paste it now let's say we want to console the articles so what we'll do we will simply log the news save this file and run it something didn't went well okay what's happening here we are getting an empty array because uh, because we have initialized with an empty array so what we have to do we have to check uh, if it's empty array then we have to return null else update the state so let's do it if news return null okay then remove this Mm, okay then import the flat list from react native then data equals we have news use state and then articles in it so news dot articles then key extractor we have to pass it a unique key so we will make it item index okay that will make a key let's say key with index so it will create a unique key every time okay then render item equals item return news cart what 
what we are doing wrong. Hmm. Okay, okay. What is wrong? We have this opened. Then we have this. Okay, that's the extra. Okay. okay now if I save this file and run it here as you can see we have successfully rendered our flat list now what next is we have to pass these item into this cart component so let's do it now go to app.js no uh, go to news card here type item item then we will have item dot title now item dot author and here item dot description description save this file and now in news what we will do uh, we have to pass uh, this item card but before that we have to use i forgot to add this now item equals item save this file if i run Okay, something we did wrong. Let me check. Okay, and then the news card. Okay, we forgot to add braces. save this file and run it as you can see the title description why the author is income uh, go to news okay news card okay author now everything is coming now we have to set the image we have this prop in image source so source then uri into item dot what is the name for the image uh, url to image url to image save this file and run it uh, okay the image is coming now this image is getting out of the view so where is image Here. remove this thing save it and run it again now perfect as you can see we are getting all images with title author and description perfect what we learned today we learn how to how to call network apis using the xeos library then we rendered into our flat list using react native hooks thank you for watching ua studios stay focused keep learning <laughs>